So we're going to talk about the safety tips with your floor model and wall model electric. They're the same tips. Yeah, the nice. most important thing you can do is shut the power off to your stove. Get your breaker. If you don't know anything about electricity, if you're not comfortable with it, hire a certified electrician. That's the best thing you can do. You can also, if you're going to do it yourself, buy a multimeter. You can buy these $20 at the hardware store that you can check the voltage to your stove to make sure there, um, make sure there's no power. Now, one really important part with this multimeter, if you're going to do this yourself, is not to get the clamps. And the reason why is because you have to physically touch the clamp and press to your, to your control to the hot. You can get shocked in the process. So if you're going to buy one of these, you want the probe kind. You don't have to physically touch the hot wire. The other important part that's a very good safety tip, this stove is stainless steel. It's very sharp on certain corners. So get yourself a nice pair of um, gloves. These are bodyguard. I think they're like five or six bucks at the hardware store. So another safety tip with this stove uh, would be in the process of the maintenance or cleaning of this stove. Uh, you're gonna want a mask. Any mask will do. This is just your basic KN95 mask. And then your gloves again. Now, that's for just your, your health and your safety as far as cleaning. This is a red Scotch pad. Uh, they sell this at the hardware store. I believe in the boxes of like 25, 30 of them. You can buy green ones and brown ones also. Now, one thing that's gonna hit over time, you want your mask on and your gloves on. 